Malian civilians are expressing gratitude and relief with the French forces inside the country aiding Mali's military against the Islamist militants holding the north of the country. The French armed forces began airstrikes in Mali on January 11th, halting the advance of the militants towards the capital Bamako. The people here are afraid. They don't know. Something should be done. But it's okay now that the French are in Mali. We are not as afraid as we were before. The International Criminal Court has recently begun an investigation into alleged war crimes being committed by the Islamist militants who currently rule Mali's north. The arrests will be made with the cooperation of the economic community of West African states, by the elements who are on the ground. All of these decisions have been taken by the International Criminal Court to be able to cooperate with the soldiers on the ground who will eventually conduct the arrests, who will identify them, arrest them and interview witnesses. In new footage released by the militants, you can see them testing explosives, burning items prohibited under Sharia law and patrolling borders. It comes after after the Islamists were said to have fled the strategic town of Diabali, which had been targeted by French airstrikes. The current military operation, which is expected to grow in scale when the full amount of French and African ECOWAS troops arrive, will most likely force hundreds of thousands of people from their homes. Some 400,000 people have already been displaced by the rebellion and Islamist uprising, which took place after a coup in March 2012.